Hey, are you all right? Uh, yes, I think so. I can't thank you enough. Man, since when did Grimoire get so grim anyway? Ah, uh, don't sweat it. Things will work out. The two of us can handle anything. Ah, a human who's able to defeat the Cogna. Is he a medium? Or has he already awakened? Either way, I know just what to do with him. Bats! Bats! Please tell me you didn't come here to start your nonsense again. There's a time and a place, okay? Right now I'm busy dismantling these doohickeys. Bats! I have awaited this day a thousand years! Did you just add a digit? You're not getting away without a duel this time. Don't you want to defeat those... Uh, 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 coggle, kabuggle, buggle, knogabog, whatever they are, I know how to stop them. Kagabuggle, nagabog, debogga, what? What? You mean the Cogna? So you know a way to beat them? Yes! Then what are we waiting for? Gmesh! I must have had you all wrong. Quick, quick! Hey, this is far enough. I want to see this secret weapon you told me about, yeah. right? <laughs> I can't believe that it was easy as he said. Now that I have you alone, we can get our clash on. Bert! Huh? Who's he? Do you know a way to stop those machines or don't you? No clue. What? <laughs> I just told you what he said I should if I wanted you to play along. Now let's get right down to the main event. True, I may not remember the finer points, but today is the day I finally picked that bone with you that I'm fairly certain I have. Excellent work luring the champion here. You've served your purpose. Get lost. Huh? What? But I haven't had a chance to settle the score with Bart. Silence! He'll meet his demise at my hands. Once they hear I defeated a champion, my rise to greater glory is all but assured. Haven't you ever heard of keeping your word? You promised I would get to fight Bart's one-on-one. -on -one. What do you know? So that's the story. This fed head played you like a fiddle, Gilgamesh. Time for you to die! I'm sorry, Bart. Where did it all go wrong? Oh, man. Once I've wiped the floor with these guys, you're in for an earful. <laughs> I'm not holding back against these bullies anymore! Agreed. They definitely have it coming to them this time. I was hoping to let off a few sparks. Judgment! Hold! That wasn't so bad. <sighs> uh, did those two just help me out? If so, they consider me grateful. We would have had a hard time with that on our own. Now, as for you, how could you let him fool you like that? Oh, I'm sorry. When he approached me, he seemed so keen on helping me find you. 
I was at my wit's end. I couldn't think of any other way to get you to fight with me. Ah, oh, come on. Why are you so fixated on fighting me? Don't move, champion. Otherwise, I can't guarantee their safety. <gasps> What? No! When did he... If you're truly a champion to these people, then you'll lay down your arms at once! Now, do as I say. What are you waiting for? Shake a leg! Right! How dare you! You just got Gilga blocked! Barks, take the villagers and get out of here! What about... Just go! This is my mess to clean up! A shame this is goodbye. Now I will never know the joy of dueling you. You know, he was really a tough nut to crack, wasn't he? But I thought he was all right. Oh, I have awaited this damn million years! Birds! This time we settle things once and for all! <laughs> How many zeros do you think you can add before that sounds ridiculous? Now, what do you say you and me get our fight on? Uh, no thanks. I'm gonna pass. <laughs> Poco, let's scram. Giddy up! Huh? Hey, come back here! Birds! like this, then it can only be a mirage with some kind of connection to my tribe. We'd better go check it out. Hmm. Is this the spot? <sighs> I can feel it. Are you the mirage who's been calling us? What is it? You don't mean to fight us! Fenrir! Get ready! Oh, cool! I didn't know Aiko's horn was real! Sure seems that way. It used to be that every summoner was the symbolized by their horn. Huh, I didn't know that. So Aiko must be descended from an ancient line of them. Got this.
job. to us like that? Huh? What? Eiko, we are so proud of you. Still so young and yet you have carried the tribe's heavy burden with head held high. Thank you. Is that the Mirage talking? Wait, I know this voice. Eiko, these are dark times and Grimoire faces a terrible crisis. The world will soon have need of the power our tribe possesses and the mirages who answer our call. The mirages who answer our call? What do you mean? Are there others out there besides Fenrir? You share a connection with many mirages. You must find them, join their power with yours, and wield it well. The future is yours. May it be bright. Ah, uh, wait! You are not alone, Eiko. The tribe will always be watching over you. Hmm. Fenrir. Know who that was? That had to have been one of my ancestors' mirages. Come to think of it, Grandfather once told me, after I celebrate my 16th birthday, I would be able to form bonds with many different mirages. But now, I need to focus on the things I can accomplish in the present. After all, I've still got a long, long way to grow. Fenrir, can I count on you to be there for me? Yeah. Grimoire is in danger. And if it needs my tribe's power, the summoner's power, then I'll share it with you. Rain. Lawn. Hello. What now? Who's so... I thought I'd run into my master, let alone get subjected to so much rigorous training. You remember the flood. That was huh? the very first sign What's of the punishment to come. The appearance of those mechanical monsters and horrible mirages. This is all the wrath of the Crimson Prophecy. And who do we have to blame for it but that heretic? She came here spouting the Azure Prophecy's lies. And now it is we who are being punished for it. She called herself a summoner, but her foolishness and blasphemy have cost us dear. You mark my- How can you say that? You can't possibly blame others for this. Oh, please, there's no mistaking it. The unbelievers have brought this upon themselves. Give me a break. If the Crimson Prophecy did turn the world upside down, there you go. What better reason not to go along with it? What did you say? How dare you ridicule the one true- Where did it come from? S -s -s Somebody sent for help! Oh, pull it together. I'll take care of this. Ah! It didn't work? Ah! <laughs> Can't you see this is all your fault? It's here because of you! You see what happens when you side with heretics? The prophecy is gonna see that we all pay! Oh, Freva. Fine. What are you planning to do about it? What? Listen to you. All this talk of prophecies and punishment, where is that going to get you? 
You want to blame others for the machines? You want to blame others for this mirage? That's fine. And then, what next? Go ahead and believe in any prophecy you want. But you better like what it gives you, if you're not going to act. So, what's your brilliant plan of action then? Yeah, we saw it. You weren't able to put so much as a scratch on that thing. Only those who believe in the prophecy shall be rewarded. There will always be times when even your best efforts fail. But the courage to give it another go, that's the steel you forge destinies with. Have it your way. Go ahead and hold out hope for some miracle, and let that mirage stomp all over you. But I'm not giving up. I'm defending this town. If the power's in my hands. Final heaven! <laughs> yes, let's go! Wow, that was one mega mighty punch! I'll say. And she never would have pulled it off if she hadn't believed in herself. She never gives up. We could all learn a lot from her. Yup, I'm gonna start right now. Lawn punch! That's what you took away from this, huh? Okay! That training paid off. How did you cause that miracle to happen? Don't diminish all my hard work by writing it off as a miracle. Honestly, you're still just a heretic. I don't care what it is you choose to believe in. But look, don't just go around fanning people's fears. Why not do something meaningful? Make the situation better. The thing about higher powers? They don't help people who don't help themselves. No way. <gasps> I suppose that's fair. So, um... I'm sorry. Oh, no. There's no need for you to apologize. With the world in such dire straits, we need to band together. Right? Help from above will come when we earn it. 